Juan Pablo Molyneux is a Chilean-born American interior designer. Based on the Upper East Side New York and Lumere Paris, France. Well-known in Europe and the Middle East. Molyneux is known for his classic and traditional style. Molyneux started his career in Santiago, and later moved to Buenos Aires, Argentina. Later, he moved to New York City. Today, he lives and works permanently in Paris, France. Molyneux has designed private residences in South America, North America, Europe, and the Middle East. In 2004, he designed the interior of the Circle de l'Union Intralé, a private members club in Paris. Molyneux is a naturalized American citizen. He is married to Pilar Valdivieso, whom he met when they were both teenagers. Depending on the project, his team and him get to explore different worlds, styles, and eras. One day, it will be 18th century Russia or Mughal period India, and the next day the golden age of French furnishings, and then the most refined modernism. Juan Pablo said, the only link between these styles and eras of design is my own taste and my way of mixing materials, textures, colors, works of art. His project always stimulate his imagination, and the challenges of each project oblige Juan to find new solutions, to build on his experience and passions. Juan Pablo, I have always traveled a great deal, even since my childhood. At the age of 20, I went to Paris to complete my studies at the École des Beaux-Arts and the École du Louvre. Juan Pablo said, I was proud to become an American citizen. I do not care about borders, as I consider myself a citizen of the world. When it comes designing, he said, this is all quite normal and part of the universal and very human desire for change and innovation. When it comes to projects, what I expect from a client for the project to be fully successful is to be motivated and that at the end of the proposal phase, he has made a decision about my proposals. There is nothing worse than indecisive personalities. Of course, changes are always possible, as long as they do not impact the main lines of a project, its foundations if you prefer. He added. My work is not only big in spirit and ambition, but it also relies on excellence to get there I consider that I work with the best craftsmen in the world who put their unique know-how at the service of my creativity. The goal of these three inspiring projects was to create the most luxury design residences in Europe. In Vienna, Austria, it is the Schott in Ring Palace, a historical building, which is in the process of being converted in the highest standard apartments according to my design plans. I collaborate in prestigious constructions operations in Mayfair, in London, and in Moscow, in Malaya Brunea. Being so close to the world of high fashion and luxury design, 
Juan Pablo Molyneux follows all of the best concepts which the industry calls trends, which is nothing more, nothing less than the perfect opportunity to sell new concepts. Juan Pablo is right. Trends come and go. When it comes to design, I have learned that anything in the past always stays strong. For example, anything in the Renaissance era or classic style design are some examples of clients requesting vintage decorating from the past. What I do find tiresome is when, in the name of the latest fashion, the end of tradition is proclaimed yet again and everyone praises the new trends, presenting them as the true future of interior design. Juan Pablo on Central Park, on the Upper East Side of Manhattan, sits a majestic limestone townhouse with graceful French balconies that look transported straight from the Gilded Age. I believe in balance, he says. I was always fascinated by a sort of casual harmony. In the second floor parlor, a circular bronze sculpture by the Italian artist Bruno Romita functions as a modern counterpoint to the checkerboard marble floors, I don't like to put down carpets, and velvet upholstered walls. Juan Pablo said, I am constantly finding beautiful pieces and I have to change a room to make them fit. Plus, he adds cheerfully, the house is rather large. So we always have new places we can work on a little bit. <laughs>